One reason I'm bringing forth this message today, I want to tell people, if you are a Christian, if you are a believer, all your troubles, all your trials, all the truth about the kingdom of righteousness and all your temptation and enduring your temptation is not in vain. Prove it, preacher. Four, th four T's that bring richness to you now and the afterlife. Hey, glory to God. The, the first one is truth of God, righteousness and kingdom. Matthew 6, 33 says, but seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and all these things shall be added unto you. So the, the rich, and the Bible says, and ye shall know the truth and the truth shall make you liberated. Stand fast in liberty where Christ has made you free and be entangled again with the yoke of bondage. That's number one. That's the first T. The second T is temptation. My friend, the Bible says he found a way for your escape so you can bear it. They know temptation is common among men, but God will have a way for your escape so you bear it. So the second one is temptation. The Bible says, blessed is the man that endured temptation, for when he is tried, he shall receive the crown of life, which the Lord hath promised to them that love him. And the third one, he glory to, is Job. We know Job's situation. I'm saying, uh, is there a Job in the house? Job 42 and 12 says, so the Lord blessed the latter end of Job more than his beginning, for he had 14,000 sheep. 6,000 camel and 1,000 yoke of oxen and 1,000 she asses. And the last, the last, thing. so we see, my friend, that we see Jesus, we see James, we see Job, and the last one is, is Joseph. And Joseph should be the first, but Joseph was also the J. Hey, glory to God, the Bible say, the trouble of Joseph, Joseph say, when he confronted his brother, he say, but as for, for you, you meant it for evil against me. But God meant it for good in order to, to, to bring it about as it is the day to save many people alive. What did Job went, what did Joseph went through? Joseph went through the pit by his brother. He was sold to part of a house. His wife lied on him. And he went to the prison. After the prison, he went to the palace. And at the palace, he was crowned prince in Egypt. So if you are going through trial and tribulation, my friend, know this, the four T's that bring richness to you now and after life. My friend, I believe the word of God. Do you believe the word of God? You are rich.